Community Transport provides minibus services for people who are unable to use or access public transport. The service relies heavily on volunteer drivers and hopefully, after watching this film, you'll be keen to volunteer and prevent older and disabled people in your local community from becoming isolated and losing their independence. In Hampshire we are very fortunate to have many active community transport schemes who provide really good local services. For its part, the County Council recognises the benefit and value that these schemes bring to their local communities. And that is the reason why I'm very pleased that we've been able to work with our partners in the community transport sector to produce this short film to promote what they do. Well, I've been a, a minibus driver for about two years. Uh, and I started because that was when I retired. Uh, so I got a bit of spare time and thought that would be quite a good thing to do. I've been a volunteer for 10 years coming now. And um, I was just walking in town and I always saw the minibuses. And uh, it's always been a passion of me driving and helping in the community as well. I retired and was looking for something to, to be a, a different challenge and decided this was what I ought to be doing. Usually um, the, the customer has already given the office um, instructions about who needs picking up, where they need picking up and where they're going and obviously the times of picking up and departure. So the office gives me all the paperwork and, and I take it on from there. The trips that I do involve people who've been perhaps a stroke club or something like that. So people who need a little bit of help, I suppose. Usually it's uh, um, loading uh, some wheelchairs, or a wheelchair at least, and uh, accompanying the people um, on their trip to where they're going. Well, it gets me out. Else I'd be sitting there looking at the goggle box. I'm a widow now, so if I did not I wouldn't, I wouldn't stop the clubs. No way. We'd have to wait until somebody offered you a lift if you want to go anywhere much. We can get the bus, but it's very risky doing the bus because I want to take this on the bus, but if they've got other wheelchairs in it, I can't get on it. In terms of finances, it costs nothing at all. Uh, we're provided with training. I went through a Maidas training, which involves being taken out on a run and um, check our driving ability more than anything else really. And a theory test, uh, but it's, it's easy to, enough to do. I enjoy it. Um, I usually, I usually um, or I've been known to tell the passengers that it keeps me off the streets. It's a challenge. You're meeting a lot of different people with a lot, lot of different needs. Yeah, I find it rewarding. It gives you an opportunity to do something during the week uh, that you can fit in with anything else that you're doing. It's very satisfying to do it. Go for it. Help someone who is in need. Yeah, it's always good to change someone's life. It's like going to the seaside on an outing, you know, and really laughing and joking. Yeah, really good. Oh, the lovely people you, you ride with. They're all very nice, all friendly. It's something to look forward to. Instead of wanting to die next week, I want to keep alive. <laughs> Community transport helps many people in Hampshire who otherwise can't get out and about. They're always looking for more volunteer drivers, so please get in touch today and make a real difference in your local area.